Welcome back. This is Joe Samo with another geometry equation. Uh, in this circle, O is the center, and what they want to find out is what is the perimeter of that sector O, R, S, T. I'll give you a couple seconds. Try this on your own. Hit the pause button, and we'll connect after that. I hope you tried it on your own. We're going to do it together now. Here's the circle. Uh, there's the center. And we have here a sector of the circle. It is 60 degrees right there. And what we want to find out is the perimeter. It says the total circumference of the circle is 18 pi. If uh, the circumference is 18 pi, we could find out the radius. The formula is the circumference equals 2 times the radius times pi, 2r pi. And if the circumference is 18 pi, then we could set that equal to 2 times the radius times pi. Divide each side by 2, then uh, we can cancel out the, the pi and pi, and then we get 9 equals the radius. If 9 is the radius, then O to R is 9, because that is a radius, and O to T is also 9, uh, because that's a radius. And what we need now is that arc right there uh, between uh, R, S, T. Uh, we need to get the perimeter of that arc. There's a formula, and that formula is the angle of a sector divided by 360 is proportionate to the perimeter of the arc over the total circumference. The angle is 60 degrees and we so we go 60 over 360 because 60 is the angle of the sector and we set that equal to the arc which we don't know what it is so we'll call it x over the total circumference is 18 pi so we have that ratio of 3 of 60 over 360 equals x over 18 pi 60 over 360 can simplify to 1/6 uh, so we have 1/6 equals x over 18 pi we could cross multiply so we have 6x equals 18 pi and uh, then we divide 6 by each side we get x equals 3 pi and there we now have the perimeter of the arc now we could just add everything up we have the first radius was 9 then we have the arc perimeter which is 3 pi and then we have the other radius which is 9 so we have 9 plus 3 pi plus 9 uh, that could simplify a little bit to 3 pi plus 18 there you go. That is a good equation. Uh, keep on practicing. You can hit the subscribe button. I'm going to keep making more of these. And uh, if you have any questions, uh, put them in the comments and we could uh, keep on moving. Thanks.